hello everyone uh, today i'm going to show you how to use a uh, camera or native plugin in ionic 4 so yeah finally ionic 4 is uh, launched on 23rd january so that is a good announcement for ionic developers so yeah um, what is the reason behind giving a demo of ionic 4 with a camera plugin uh, that looks uh, like we feel that is a similar as ionic 3 but uh, there is uh, some changes and uh, which is not mentioned in ionic uh, documentations so yeah let's uh, start with that created already uh, all component of ionic 4 project so yeah uh, that way we can uh, the video yeah so you have to create ionic 4 project after the updating the ionic cli yeah. uh, now move to the ionic website <coughs> ionic .com. yeah you, you can see the framework documentation yeah. that is the brand new website for ionic 4 if you have to look on uh, the version you can see the menu here v3 yeah, yeah. let's uh, go to the net and look for camera net plugin yeah that is so yeah here you can see the ionic Cordova plugin at Cordova plugin camera that is correct and npm installed at the red ionic native camera here is the some change which is not mentioned here so let's uh, quickly verify that and just to move to the npmjs.com yeah. <coughs> if you have to copy this name uh, mm. sorry just uh, yeah npmjs.com yeah just press enter yeah here you can see the Ionic native camera which is launched be just before the four days ago. Yeah, so just click on that. Here you can see the this is the same line, but the second line which is not module for Ionic native. Here they are mentioned at the red beta, which is not mentioned here. And so this is the one change we have to keep in mind when we use Ionic uh, native plugin with ionic 4 yeah so uh, I already installed that uh, plugin but let's install it again just copy that yeah. press enter yeah install it successfully yeah and just go to the 10 pm test.com and copy this don't forget to add at that beta so they are installing <coughs> yeah also we will verify that uh, ionic native folder inside a node module uh, we will look inside that ionic 4 folder and we will look in ionic 3 folder after this uh, installation yeah install successfully yeah uh, that is the all com yeah all component is uh, ionic 4 project and uh, here is the node module and here is the ionic native folder here is the camera folder here you can see the ngx folder which is uh, comes with latest version of ionic native node modules this is my ionic 3 project node module ionic native camera here you cannot see the ngx folder so this is the uh, difference in ionic native camera plugin in ionic 4 yeah so just uh, go to the documentation website yeah 
uh, here they are asking we have to import camera options yeah. uh, just copy that line go to the app.module.ts file and that means my font bigger so that's easy to read read yeah here uh, if you notice the splash screen and status bar plugin they are previously like this there is a no uh, ngx folder after the uh, splash plugin name and yeah so that is things we have when uh, we imported ionic native and camera so after that we have to write ngx which is going up ngx folder in a node module here here yeah so just remove the camera option from that just copy the camera and in, uh, add in a provider here. Yeah. so that's we are done in a app dot module ts yeah now go to the home the page dot ts file here yeah so go to the website copy the same line here also don't forget to add ngx yeah also we copy the constructor from here as well so we are dot after that we create one function start camera yeah. so that is called from home.page.html file so they call that uh, function start camera and start the camera and help us to uh, grab the image from the camera here we are using the data url so we will get page 64 and we will display the image part in a html after capturing the image yeah so i already created build for that so i'm going to show you the preview yeah, I'm starting the application on a device so yeah just uh, go to the chrome chrome dot chrome column slash inspect yeah here you can see the inspect click on that yeah, here you can see the simple preview like start camera I'm clicking on that so yeah the tab is inactive because camera is started on the device so we cannot see here so I'm capturing the image. Yeah, mm, click on choose. Yeah. So here you can. I'm seeing the image on the device that is not rendering here because mm, there was some communication issue with device to the browser. So just just click on the hide the device and click on that. So here you can see the image so that is the thing uh, whenever we start with ionic 4 just keep in mind uh, we have to import all this plugin native plugin from the ngx folder so don't forget to do that yeah mm, thanks for watching and keep setting